Gada 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 oh, I've been married a long time ago. Where do you come from? What do you go? What do you come from? Bukla. Yo and what's up every funny Roblox gamers? So, as you can see from the title and thumbnail, this Roblox anime game just added a Utah domain expansion. And this game is probably be the first Roblox anime game to have it, because the Utah domain expansion just came out in the latest chapter of Jujutsu Kaisen, and I haven't seen any Roblox anime game did it yet. And if you are wondering what this Roblox anime game is, it is Project Baki 3 again. Well, if you are my subscriber, you will know that I made a lot of videos in this game because they are so fast about making new stuff. Anyway, let's stop yapping and checking how to obtain Yuta in this game. So as I see on Trello, to obtain Yuta in this game, first you have to bring him a sandwich which is selling in the shop near him, and the main parts are killing 20 Yasha Apes, killing 5 Yasha Ape Juniors in Boss Rush, killing 10 first Yasha Apes, and buying Yuta's ring for 20 million yen from the broken man. Oh boys, this is going to be real suffering because Yasha apes spawn every 30 minutes and I have to kill 20 of them. And since I have to kill so many apes, this spec should match. Now let's go find Yuta. And there he is. I'm starving after that plane ride. Got any food I could kill for a sub? Yeah, we're gonna have to buy him sandwich. And this should be the shop that sells sandwich. Bruh. Bro, this sandwich probably can cure cancer. Thanks. Let's get to work. There is a horde of black furred apes around this area. Kill exactly 10, not one more, not one less. Wait, isn't it on Trello it said kill 20 apes? Well, that's good, I think. But before I go kill apes, I have to grind for spirits first so I can just use maximum Uzumaki and one-shot it. And this should be enough to one-shot apes. Many unbearable hours later. Okay guys, so I have killed about seven apes with super suffering and pain, and I just know that to spawn the first Yasha ape, you have to kill two normal Yasha apes to get its head and spawn it. You may think it's not that hard, but overall you still have to kill more than 40 apes, not including the five apes that I have to kill in boss rush. That means it's going to take me about a week to do it, and you know I have to do other things too, so to solve this problem I'm going to... Yep, I'm not going to fake this video. Wow! Wanna break from the ants? Hey, you over there. Have you ever bored of the old looking look of your old Roblox website? Don't worry, I have the best Roblox extension to make your life easier and cooler. Rogo! With Rogo, it revamps everything on the Roblox front page from this noob looking to an insane look and more modern. And it's not just look modern, but it also come with countless feature to make your life easier. You can choose descending or ascending player number, and you can also choose the regions to join the server that has lowest ping as possible. And for streamer, Rogo also has has streamer mode, which hide all of your information which include your name and Robux. You can just see all of your private server subscriptions to deactivate or renew them. Next feature is you can filter your avatar item by keyword, and one of my favorite is you can select multiple item like your hair or accessories. And Rogold also has a best friend feature, where you can choose your best friend and they will appear on the first page. And the coolest feature is that there is a level system in which you can level up by playing a game, and the more levels you get, the more you can can unlock these cool avatars border, profiles, banners, and avatar homes. So use Rogold now to make your life quality greater. Yes, it's actually a good extension. And now let's go check the Yuta. Oh, hello, yeah. All right, start off with M1 combo as always. Sing, 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 sing. And the first move is Slice of Life. So in this move, you rushes forward performing yeah. multiple slashes around them, slicing anyone in the vicinity. And next move is Heaven Sent. And in this move, you leaps into the air and comes back slashing down wherever and whoever you land on. Third move is the Promise Ring. And for this move, you put on the ring which grants you the ability to unleash your limits and gives you a significant damage boost and damage redirection. And the fourth move is Straight Stab and True Promise. So basically, in these moves, you toss up your opponent and impales them, ragdolling them. And the moves will switch to True Promise when the opponent is at 20% or lower, where the user decapitates them. 
And the fifth move is complete manifestation. And basically you can steal other people's spec for 20 seconds. And now the time you might be waiting for is domain expansion. And I just know that you can't just use domain expansion because you still have to kill 2,000 Kenjaku users. Yeah, I am serious. But there is also another option, which is paying 400 Robux. Well, we all know that the quest is just impossible, so I have to buy it again. And yeah, let's see if it worth it. Oh, okay, that's not bad, but also not so good. And this is explanation of this skill. The user chants the ritual phrase, Zhen Yan Xiang Ai, all-encompassing, unequivocal love. This brings out the user's domain expansion, which is a large bare stone canyon containing shambled rock structures and is covered in blades. Here, the user can use any of the following moves to their will due to the skills replacing their base move set as the opponent is stuck in place and are guaranteed to be hit. Well, the information of the skill might be weird because I got it from Trello, and the following move that they said on Trello are Jolly Kenjutsu's Whirling Blizzard, Satoru Gojo's 200% Hollow Purple, Sukuna's World Cleave, Kenjaku's Maximum, Uzumaki, Goku Black, Reese, this is the work of a god, Toto Aoi's Boogie Woogie, Mahito's Offensive Transfiguration, Kazuya's Devil Fist, Devil God Fist, Ryu's Shoryuken, Sawpang's Hammer of Burma, Satoru Gojo's Cursed Technique, Reversal Red, Gaolang's God Glow, and Kaiwan's Devil Lance. Yep, that is just so much, and I can't even show it all because it's random every time you use the domain expansion. You yeah, boy. Wait, what? Ah! <laughs> Oh my god! Bruh. Huh? Oh no! 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 So yeah, I really love how when I am done editing this video, Sakura Stan just post a sneak peek of Utah Domain Expansion.